Championship. So guys, we're back. King's oh, Wrestling Talk is back, and it's the next match: Charlotte versus Natalia. This is going to be one of the matches, guys. That could be even. We don't know. So we're going to sit back and enjoy it, guys. So here's our reaction. What is what it was back there? Down with his chair. It's obvious. Oh, and Natalia me. sitting outside the ring. Oh, Naomi. Oh, Naomi. Well, what well, did I tell you, Naomi? Straight away, you get top. Taking a cheap Naomi. Oh, my God. Naomi. Straight away, you get top. Taking a cheap. Naomi took a walk on the team of Naomi and Charlotte. Natalia didn't injure Naomi. Then certainly helped. And there goes Charlotte Flair outside. Right to Lana Carmella and Tamina. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right, taking out Charlotte. I think that was simply payback for what Naomi started. She's to blame in all this. Oh, just notice how how the riot squad moves and cohesive. All three of them notice at all times. She also has a bit of an attitude for them. Oh, bloody ice she does. 2013 <laughs> Vision Byron, which makes me better than you. Then move by Charlotte. Backbreaker by a big mouth. Oh. Oh. Kick right there, now into the cover. To Say she's the, the best there is, the best there was, the best there ever will be. Again, both oh, these superstars have to be very, very you know, getting down to her, find the actual best of the 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 the Doing her best to oh, show Charlotte. Oh, that was a stiff foot of the ring again. Right this is what I'm talking about. This is the Ryan squad. And now Carmella is getting involved as well. Hi, Ian. Why is this squad? 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 I told you guys, I mean, this thing's going to pop off sooner or later. You can't put all these combustible yeah, elements together. Natalia is forcing you to pop off. I want to close it again. What is this? This is brilliant strategy by the Italian. Again, it says to me, I can't beat Charlotte myself. Let me put it in the hands of the Lumberjack. And all six of the women this side get it in front. Naomi's the only one to oh, call it out of Charlotte. Fine, you can sit there and be a Charlotte Flair apologist all you want. The fact <laughs> is, what the Italian's doing, it's working wonderfully right now. Boom, let's Ooh. do it again. Baseball slides in oh, there outside again. Perfectly. Here's okay. my issue. Natalia talks about how great of a champion she was. And she's been the this will be a perfect the time for Carmella to cash in after the match. Because if you think about it, guys, Carmella cash in after this match. They're both going to be absolute brutal and taken down. And they're going to be winded. And this will be the best time for any opportunity for somebody to cash in. I think Carmella should take on this. But again, guys, well, not even take on, just watch this match very carefully. Tell that to Captain Righteous to your left. Look, all I'm saying is don't be a hypocrite, okay? If you're going to be Natalia and talk about how proud you are of your family legacy and upholding the Hart family legacy, but don't take shortcuts like you are here. Oh, see, because we weird. I've seen you remember this thing called the Hart Foundation. You did a whole bunch of that and won a whole bunch of championships in the process. You're not going to win this one, Saxton. Riot Squad looking on as Natalia has a firm grasp here on Charlotte Flair, Carmella, Tamina, and Lana iron this championship match. This is fantastic. Think of all of the all, all the energy that Natalia has reserved to this point by throwing Charlotte to the outside, letting the ladies at ringside handle most of the workload. This is brilliant. This is this is a strategy to become the champion. Like, what, what, what happened to Natalia to become a champion? Where does that confidence take her? Does she become a sitting duck now because now she's got the entire division coming after her? Did she hold on to that title on her own? Why are you worried about stuff that hasn't happened yet, Byron? We'll cross that bridge when we get to it. I think about the future. I think about possibility. Now look at what Italia's doing now and how they cost her in the future. Well, it's entirely possible, Byron, that I could be the Pope someday, but that's not going to happen, okay? Maybe that's never going to happen. Get hypotheticals. Right, so oh, man. Look, and now Natalia, oh, the one. There's a low drop kick. And despite uh, everything Natalia's done here in this matchup, she got to the top of the Jacks or the state of Charlotte Flair's in right now. Charlotte's in the match with Charlotte. Not exactly right. right. Absolutely brutal. You, you, we have a virtual handicap match going on. You picked those weight. 
I did. Jack's I'm sorry. They're surrounding the ring. I'm sorry. I can't ignore them. I can't ignore them when they completely ambushed the women's champions. Well, see what's happening inside so the ring. So if you think about it again, Italian this dominant side that Natalia is giving Charlotte. Italian slides over oh. right to the outside. Maybe I spoke a bit too soon. It's a hit. Righteousness yeah. Byron about Charlotte Flair. There was this guy called Ric Flair who had the four horsemen. Oh. Yeah, he was all about underhanded oh. tactics too. So let me keep poking holes in your theory. Not poking holes in my theory. Don't come out here and make excuses for losing the title if you're Natalia. Natalia's not the champion, dummy! Natalia is the one who came out here and claimed that she didn't successfully defend her title. Oh, this is going to be a really going up to the top. Oh, oh. That's costly for Charlotte. I'm going to fact check we can do that too. The punishment that Charlotte Flair has endured to this point just too much. You can tell she was a step slower than usual, and Natalia made the queen pay. Trying to step through here. The submission special is one of the short shooter shot there by Charlotte. Reversal pin up. Two. Oh, it's out. the two count. Oh, oh boy. Boy. Boots. And for a second, can Charlotte Flair right herself in this match? So better on the verge of more than just riding herself. That better yet, can she close it out now? Sit out. So oh, no. And Charlotte just took me yeah, right yeah. out there. And I'm more than so All over Flair. Here come the rest of the lumberjacks. Is it going what? Byron Ruby? Ruby Lyle was here. Oh, oh, it's a blast. It is a blast. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Self defense, sex. No, God. Oh, my God. No. Yeah, now. So, so ridiculous. Naomi I'm ridiculous. I'm ridiculous. Naomi condoning all this. Naomi said she watched Charlotte's back, but those two, the champion and the challenger, are right in the mix of this. And it's been thrown back inside the ring. Charlotte oh, Ryan on the outside now. Oh. Again, oh. another momentary delay that lets Natalia capitalize. Oh, oh look, look at Tamina with a kick. Another cheap shot. Boom, boom. Natalia's gonna be proud of this. Yeah, she should be. Natalia's closing in on the champion we want. Championship reign. That's a champion we want. Represent SmackDown. The sharpshooter's locked in. Hard throwing sharpshooter here on Charlotte Flair. Can Natalia regain the SmackDown Women's Championship? Charlotte's got to try and find a way to get to the bottom rope here. She does Charlotte doesn't have an ally in the world right now. Can she yeah, get to the rope? That no, Charlotte she is still fighting. Oh, still fighting. oh still man, fighting. Italian, Italian might have, have this. How long can Charlotte possibly hold on? Here are the screams of Natalia trying to get Charlotte Flair to submit here at Clash of Champions. You can hear the riot squad on the outside yelling, tap out, Charlotte. Charlotte, oh, yeah, anything but tapping out again. Charlotte trying to preserve her existence in this matchup. Charlotte not giving up. Uh, and she get there, yes, and that'll break the submission. Oh, well, 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 look at this. Why don't you? The Lord has well, pulled well, superstars out of the match. Come on. The, so we knew this was going to happen. Yeah, it's been happening all match. Charlotte's oh, been getting the face down. Man, this is insane. Of course you love it. It's fantastic! All of the Lumberjacks, the champion and challenger caught up and... I love it wait, 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 wait. Carmella just grabbed the money in the bank briefcase. I told you she was going to cash in! I told you! Wait a minute, Ruby oh, no. Ryan right on Carmella. And Ruby Ryan may have just spoiled Carmella's plans. And the rest of the Riot Squad and the Lumberjacks flooding the ring. The Riot Squad's been spoiling a lot of plans over the last few weeks. And look at the Lumberjacks, they battle through the ring now, outside. Oh, by the way, we still have a match going on. And Charlotte and Natalia, oh, and they've been pursuing, it seems, just on their own melee. Oh, Natalia trying to fend off Naomi there, but going up top. What is Charlotte thinking? Oh, we know exactly what she's thinking. Oh, outside. Down goes the entire SmackDown Women's Division. And so oh, Natalia, the first one up. And Natalia was able to avoid the moonsault. Oh. 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 Oh.
And Charlotte knew she had to do something Man, drastic. She knew she had to Man, I'm gonna tell you, my is doing this. Charlotte is the only strategy she could utilize. Charlotte might be out, guys. She went face first into that ring post very, very hard. And now it might, not, it might only be a matter of time here for Natalia. Again, all the lumberjacks are down outside the ring. Charlotte Flair has barely moved. And a big smile on the face of Natalia. She knows he has Charlotte. Reverse into the figure four. Oh, 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 Charlotte picks up that victory, guys. Talia got too cocky. Talia got too cocky. She did. I thought for a second Natalia may have just won that match. But it goes to show you, if you're not focused enough, even in a lumberjack match, your opponent can always up in your ante. And that's what happened tonight. Charlotte is still women's champion. Well, I thought that as well. So there you go, guys. Charlotte picks up the win over Natalia. We're going to be back for the next match, guys. So stay tuned for more. Remember, guys, like, subscribe, and we'll give you more live reviews just like this. So, guys, thank you so much, and we'll see you back for the next match.